Hello Katie and MyNaturalHappiness.com, creator of the Seeds of Change programme to help you go from hamster wheel to happiness. Founder of Shine Your Light Goddess, Shine Your Light, the boot camp and the book. I hope you're well, I hope you're having an amazing time and oh, I hope you're having the most beautiful January. I, oh, I'm waiting to get the phone call that we've finally exchanged on my move. It's nerve wracking. So deep breathing and trusting that what is meant to be will be we're all lined up and we're just waiting for the solicitors to do their thing so and breathe so ah oh, thank you to all of you so that's why my energy is a bit like oh, it's exciting and nerve-wracking all at the same time trust so uh, thank you to those who are coming along to the Manifest Your Perfect Year workshop. We are having a beautiful and sacred time. It is a small sacred group this year. I haven't done as many promotions as I would normally do because it's got a lot going on with my move. And it's been a beautiful, beautiful sacred time. There's still time to catch up. Just come over into the Kate's Corner of Happiness and watch the replays. And you are so welcome there. And if you haven't had time this week, you can catch up next week. It's all good. It's all in Kate's Corner of Happiness. Just go and have a look and you can do some catching up as well. So you haven't missed the boat. Ah, sending you a big hug of love. Hug of love. As always, I pulled out a card for you for watching this video and um, it's so perfect for me and I hope it speaks to you. The first card we have is from Wendy Andrews, Goddess Dream Deck, Letting Go, Letting Go, Emotional Release. And with me waiting for this phone call from the solicitor, it makes, oh, it makes me feel like, and all will be okay. All will be okay. Letting go. Emotional release. There may be times when the waves crash over and around you and it takes all of your strength and energy just to hold on to where you are. You may long for the seas to settle so that you can see the clear horizon and be calm, but the storm rages on and you are exhausted from holding on tight to stay in one place. The mother of water is here to tell you that you can let go. You are part of her and if you surrender yourself to her flow, it will no longer feel like you're being battered by the storms. Instead, you can rise and fall in the swirling waters, exhilarated and free. You are at one with her, flowing with her. When you weep, she holds your tears. When you Fuss, she foams, stirs and then settles. When you laugh, she ripples and splashes. And when you reveal yourself, she hears you and holds you within her all-encompassing embrace. Do not be afraid to dive into the emotional depths of your being. Mother of Water will be there holding your sadness, pain and frustration, your jealousy, your anger or your fear. Whatever your emotion, she knows them all. She will act as a mirror, peer into her and see how your emotions are affecting your thoughts and your actions. Are they helping your well-being and are the well-being of others? If not, Mother of Water invites you to let them go. Release them into her flow and she will carry them away. When negative emotions overwhelm you, remember that you can surrender and let Mother of Water carry you safe in her loving embrace. How perfect is that? Certainly speaking to me with where everything's going on in my world and I hope that that speaks to you. And I have learned that when we step out of the holding on and into the flow, then things do shift and change. And you know, this is the third house chain that I've got. This is the furthest I've got. Um, but the first house chain, um, well, two house chains didn't work for various reasons. And this is the third one. And I was absolutely devastated. If anybody remembers watching the videos, I was absolutely devastated. And yet I was saying, I know there'll be a reason. It will be okay. I know there'll be a reason. And 
for me whenever I've stepped out of that you know of course I was upset and of course I had, was in tears and of course I struggled with that and I trust I mean it you know by stepping into flow it allowed me to go into this next phase and to find this next house which is even more perfect than the first two that um, I thought were perfect but on reflection weren't um, so yeah I'm trusting and if things aren't going your way trusting that there's something better for you can make all the difference so the affirmation I'm aware of my emotions if an emotion is having a negative effect on my life or those of others I can choose to release it letting go emotional release so if you're carrying an awful lot if you're carrying worries or strains or worry or concerns let let her, let it all go into the waters the emotional release and uh, and release to the mother of water and it's easier said than done but sometimes it can be as simple as just saying i release this for now i release this for now if anybody's been watching my videos or coming onto the facebook lives at the end of the day um that we've been doing every day at five past five i always say place your worries at your feet just for this hour just for this time and then you can pick them up if you choose to and it can just help navigate very stressful times so that's your first card for the week for watching this video and the second deck is from my deck of cards and it's again perfect we've got love love so you love those around you you love so deeply and yet you are struggling to have the unconditional love for yourself that perhaps you have for your fur babies or those around you this card is encouraging you to go within love yourself exactly as you are not whom you think you should be you are imperfectly perfect as are all the souls who walk this planet you are being called at this time to simply love yourself unconditionally with this unconditional love comes the courage to show up as you are and then you can see the magic unfold enjoy this so much love and the reason why i say that's so perfect is that Every month this year in Shine Your Light Goddess, the boot camp, um, where I'm adding in, that every month we'll work with a specific goddess for the time of year. And in February, we're working with Aphrodite, the goddess of love, to help bring some love into our beings. And, and that when I'm saying love, I'm saying love for ourselves, love for our life, love for those around us, and just reconnecting to that energy of love to raise our vibrations to that that energy of love um and so it's so perfect because we're coming into the month of love and that's where i am we, we're just working with aphrodite to bring that beautiful energy of love in so so perfect from that perspective and that's on top of the eight modules um the eight modules that we've got uh that help you shed the shackles of the past both this life and previous lives to do that inner work to help you just uncover the things that just have been weighing you down and release those so that you can step forward and shine your light bright in this world raise your energy to the energy of manifestation and your vibration of beautiful magicness and then step into that beautiful beautiful vortex where you can achieve your dreams wishes and goals um it's such a beautiful sacred space and there is an offer that is available until the 31st of january there'll be links below this video um and links in the email if you're watching the email right i'm going to sign off because uh, i'm waiting to um yeah hear back i'm trusting i'm trusting i'm trusting that what it's meant to be will be and i'm trusting but we're all lined up and everybody seems to be in agreement um so yeah be a club i hope you are well have a magical magical week and i will ah oh, see you next week or over in kate's corner of happiness or on our shine your light goddess shine your light call be a club have a magical 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 week lots of love kate mynaturalhappiness.com